everyone, it's me, Vargar. I'm here with Thief Deadly Shadows. Now, this is a really old game, okay? And I haven't played it before. Um, but in lieu of the new Thief coming out, I thought maybe we should, you know, visit something older to see where it stemmed from. So uh, I thought about doing a playthrough of it, and I ended up, you know, buying it and doing a playthrough of it. So we're going to go I got ahead a tip last night from my fence. Heartless Perry. A nobleman named Lord Julian had some sort of quarrel and showed up at a local inn well after nightfall and in a foul mood. He's carrying a velvet bag about the size of a man's fist and it never leaves his sight. Sounds likely to be valuable. But I'll know for sure when I steal it from him. Perry sent over a floor plan of the place, the Blue Heron Inn. Finding his lordship won't be hard. His room number will be in the guest register, if I can get to the front desk to read it. Okay, okay, yeah, whatever, right. The inn will have guards, but not as many as a private estate. That should make things easy, which is one of the reasons I'm willing to try it without knowing for sure what the take will be. Okay, okay. Lord Julian is so protective of that bag. There's got to be something of value in it. All right, cool. So basically that's it. Okay, we got the difficulty. We're going to do go ahead and do normal goals. Obviously breaking the gear. Okay, I got some pretty neat gear here. I'm not even sure what's going on with that. But uh, Start, I guess. Oh, maybe I should look at the map. Mm, probably would have been a good idea, but I didn't. Oops. <laughs> it's okay. We'll figure it out, I think. Hopefully. Anyways, we'll figure it out. On the last day, there will be no more words, and we will what? Oh, come on. Oh, it's a training mission? Okay, throughout the rest of the game, we come towards the game. Give instructions at every step to get started, follow the footprints in the ground, and first training experience. Ah, cool, okay, so there's footprints in the ground. All right, I'm here. Um. No, oh, okay. Don't do stuff when you hide, shadow, they won't be able to see you. Uh, if you guys want to read that, you can. Okay, I'm just going to go ahead and walk past this guy just because I feel like it. Oh, cool. Okay. That worked really well. Okay, guards, be on patrols. Learn to observe your enemies and use careful timing to slip by them when their backs are turned. Okay, well, I mean, I could have guessed that one by itself, but whatever. I'm just going to stay here and wait for this guy to do whatever he's going to do. Alright, anyways, he's kind of dumb. That's that's whatever, though. He can have fun with that. So I'm just going to go ahead and go this way. Aha, training is successful. Sounds you make can alert guards. You must learn to move quietly. Foot steps are louder, so I can creep by holding down control for me. Oh, my bad. I hit the wrong one. <laughs> that was funny. I'm going to creep by holding control. Okay, cool. So I can press C to crouch. I'm crouching. Ha ha. I don't know what that is, but I'm gonna jump down here. Oh, what is this? I can highlight an item and press E to use it. Like, oh, like a door. Oh, that is so cool. This is a really old game, and you can do all this in here. Oh yeah, I picked up a box. What can I do with it? Can I set it down. Oh. Anything with it. <gasps> I throw the box. That just seems really awesome. I can. Oh. Okay. Half a water arrow. Shoot it. Ha. -ha. Okay. It created a shadow. Press space to climb over the boxes. Ha. -ha. Well, this isn't so bad. It's actually pretty decent for a really old game. Uh, lock door, no obstacle. Press E to enter your lock picking mode. Use the mouse to pick lock. You must find the sweet spot in each stage to make progress now. It's the strongest thing find the sweet spot. Stay in long enough, you'll complete the stage. Go in the lock, proceed to the door. Okay, well this probably isn't any different than the other. Whoa. Am I even moving anything? Oh, hey, I did it. Ah, easy. Check that out. What? 
No obstacle. But I don't know this game. It's like it should be no obstacle for a thief. Ah, there it goes. Ha ha! That wasn't too terribly bad. It's a little, a little different. Can I just walk up the ladder? Oh yeah, I can. Okay, cool. Sweet. Okay. Uh. What? Sneak up on them. The blackjack. <laughs> Freaking back of the head. Oh, here you're out, Cole, aren't you? Okay, so if you leave bodies, am I getting noticed? Oh, so you can pick the bodies up? Oh, snap. It's on, dude. Can I throw it? Can I throw the body down there? <gasps> I threw the body. This is like the precursor to the Splitter Cell. Except it's a lot. Okay, Lord Julian is who I was looking for, and he's in the Peony Suite. Wherever that's at. I have no Lord idea where that's at. Julian. Wouldn't do to have anyone think he was just Julian. M key for a map. I... What the heck? I don't even understand this map. You know what? I'm just not even going to worry about it. Oh, I was pushing the wrong button. <laughs> Alright. What is this? Loot? Okay, yeah, yeah I can steal it. Aha! By the way, if you guys want to read any of these things, you can just pause it, you know, or something like that and read it, because I'm just going to go ahead and try to get through all this so that I can go ahead and get to real episodes, because obviously this is a training mission, and I didn't know it. So, in the wall fighting mode, it's very close to the wall, press R. Okay, cool. So, wait, how do I, just like, is this for practice? <gasps> That's kind of neat. Okay, cool. So, I can just do that. Cool beans. Oh, oh. Uh, how do I do this? No Noisemaker. Do I have one of those? What? I thought I didn't have one. Whatever. We got this. All right. What's all the noise about? Ha! <laughs> Give me that candlestick. Uh, oh, to view my objectives. Ding. Still Lord Julian's velvet bag. Well, that's absolutely just wonderful. You know, I, I plan on doing that. <gasps> hey, look. That's kind of neat. What is this? Another piece of loot. Friend and honor Lord Julian, I will meet you at the Lancaster room tonight. I trust you'll be mindful of the risks involved and be generous. Morris the cook. I don't know who that is, but we're going to go ahead. He's gone for a walk. Can't have gone far. Ah. Okay. Okay, cool. So I got a canceled objective and a new objective, right? Does that work? Think. <laughs> I just like throwing stuff everywhere. What's the new objective? Find Lord Julian in the Lancaster room and steal his velvet bag from him. Okay, well that shouldn't be too hard. I hope not. <gasps> There's a piece of loot! I don't know what's going on here. He's sitting here, sitting near the fire, talking to someone. His purse is right next to him. So sneak up and steal the purse without being seen or heard by anyone in the room. So when you've got the purse, proceed in the kitchen, stick to the shadows, walk silently, blah, 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 blah. Blah blah blah. Give me a light, Jim. Was it like? Oh, the, the little middle thing. Oh, he is sitting right there, and there's his purse on the table. Yeah, it just glowed a little bit. Okay, that's no biggie. Makes my blood boil. They'll get theirs sooner or later. I have no idea who you are. My lord, five picked men with me, and we cut our. Hey, what? We'll just. Out this line. I right won here. the bet. My shaft was closer by a thumb's width. The bloodline opal should rightfully be mine. If I may, my lord, I can help you. I know the castle. Well, you're a cook. What could you know? Every evening after sunset, the supply wagon comes through that gate and into the courtyard. And no one looks twice. 
Arrange for your men to be inside one evening. And then we cut our way through. Five good men against twenty. And my accursed cousin. My lord, listen. There is a passage leading into mm. the castle from the courtyard. I can open it for you when you give me the signal. The torch in the lion's head sconce. You must put it out. The well, lion's head torch. Yes. And when I reach the I vault no idea what and the bloodline opal, I will take my place as head of the family. Side. The lady Elizabeth will be waiting. Even now she'll be flattering him. This Give is an interesting plot line, isn't it? Right here. Only the medallion Maybe. is the only key, my lord. You must keep hold of it. You forget Lord Ember has another. I hear he guards it with his life. My lord, I wish only for peace and... What? My hotch, it's there you are. <laughs> Let's go. No. This God's God's Nothing. Let's okay, that was weird. Uh, uh, but I've still got the goods. What's that? Nothing? Nothing at all. It's not anything at all. Did I win? Maybe? Did I win? I don't know. I think it just froze on me. What? What? That's not cool at all. Mm -hmm. Oh, well. Well, you know what? I guess I'll go ahead and end this episode because that's a little weird. Hopefully, we can figure out what's going on there. Anyways, so that being said, thanks for watching. If you liked the video, please feel free to like and comment and also subscribe if you haven't already it helps me out a lot lets me that you guys want me to keep making some videos so once again thanks for watching we'll see you next time Bye. oh i got a chobo hope you about you there's a red shit there's a red remember those giant yellow birds there's things. several reds oh my god i tamed one for, okay we're dead that's it we're dead